hello guys for today's video we will review this 2024 toyota innova e variant all right compact mpvs like the toyota innova are among the toyota motor philippines best selling models with its seven seats elevated ride height and diesel engine the Innova has established itself as a reliable option in every MPV in the market. This is uh, basically explains why Innova is always a top seller each year, which is uh, evidence of its popularity among Filipino drivers. The measurements of the Innova 2.8 E diesel automatic transmission are 1,795 mm in terms of height by 1830 mm in terms of width and 4735 mm in terms of length this e variant comes with manual or automatic transmission same with the the g variant and of course the v variant yun yung top of the line so makikita natin dito yung headlight naka halogen tapos yung turn signal light dito and yung front fascia i believe this is similar doon sa g at saka sa yung top of the line we also have here the fog light wala lang tayong makikita dito na camera sa front at saka sensor and uh, yung look and feel dito sa front fascia is more or less similar doon sa other variants yung gulong at sa yung rim size nya is 205 by 65 Rim size is 16, alloy wheel. So, yung side mirror, naka body color, may turn signal repeater, walang 360 yung camera. And then, yung handle is body color. So, makikita natin guys, yung uh, rim niya or yung mags niya is similar doon sa G variant. Naka drum type pa din yung braking system dito sa likod. Naka shark fin na din yung antenna. And meron na ding spoiler dito sa likod. So, pasok tayo dito sa driver. So, dito naka-fabric. Yung side. And then, hindi uh, automatic lahat yung mirror. Yung sa driver lang. And then, uh, black yung color dito sa handle. And, uh, of course, yung adjustment ng upuan is manual. Of course, this is the E-variant. Uh, hindi naka leather and uh, fabric lang yung seats which I believe no this is the most practical variant among the lineup yung E variant so sa steering wheel walang leather wrap mayroon mga controls tapos dito is uh, combination of silver matte finish yung uh, accent ng steering wheel sa dashboard naka hard plastic mayroon cup holder dito Then dial type yung mga controls ng AC. And uh, we have here the 6.75 inch screen on this model. Then uh, yung dashboard perspective. Meron ding uh, lagay ng uh, rings dito. Yung automatic shifter, top holders, lagay ng gamit. And then yung modes, echo and power. So isang cup holder, manual yung handbrake. Naka hard plastic yung center console. Yung sunglasses holder. Naka halogen yung cabin lights. Dito naman tayo sa likod. Same pa din na naka-fabric. Okay, may uh, cup holder dito. Yung speaker. Pasok tayo sa second row. So, meron ding hook dito. A maximum 4 kg. Pwede yung mailagay natin na gamit. Then, meron dito uh, socket. 
We also have here a small storage for the dashboard perspective. This is the signature dashboard of Innova, except don't the Zenex. So for me lang ha, uh, very practical itong e-variant. Meron ding um, aircon vents dito, yung control ng EC. And yung grab handle, naka-halogen, yung light. Yung legroom, okay din naman yung uh, legroom dito. So wala lang ang grab handle dito sa gilid. So dito sa likod, I think same lang din naman ng uh, design no? so for the G and the V. Uh, we have here the reflector. Then yung napansin ko dito guys sa E, G at saka sa V, itong piano finish na black which is uh, common doon sa tatlong variants. So meron ding camera, rear camera. So, tignan natin dito sa sa likod. So, yung folding is sa side pa din. And, uh, meron ding aircon vents dito sa third row. So, yung ano lang talaga dito guys is yung folding is nasa side. No? Yun talaga yung uh, signature ni Innova. Or tuner uh, nasa gilid yung uh, folding and hopefully in the future no, uh, makakaroon ng development in terms of folding dito sa third row in terms of suspension um it is equipped with a four-link coil spring system while the front rides on an independent coil spring double wishbone suspension with stabilizer. Rack and pinion naman yung power steering. In terms of safety naman, airbags for the driver and passenger as well as side and curtain shield, airbags are among the safety features of the in Toyota Innova. Uh, for higher versions or variant, the extra benefit of a knee airbag is also enjoyed by the driver. This MPV also has the vehicle stability control, hill start assist, and an emergency stop signal in addition to airbags. And for all versions naman, uh, included na yung EBD, ABS, uh, as a standard equipment. The Innova has an abundance of seat belts with 3-point seat belts and isofix theaters for child seats installed in the second row of seats. The same up, up front treatment is provided to the driver and front passenger. All rear passengers in the third row are also equipped with three-point seat belts. As a passive safety feature, side impact beams are standard on all models. The MPVs like the G and the V models of this uh, MPV include um, backup sensors and uh, it has also immobilizer and a security system. Yung price of pala nito is 1,386,000 pesos with a 20% all-in down payment of 102,000 and then 24 months 62,663, 36 months 44,089, 48 months 34,860, and 60 months 29,431. Subject pa din yan for bank approval. So yung computation pala na ito is uh, based on a 20% all-in down payment. Special thanks po pala sa Toyota Talisay City Branch uh, for allowing us to have this unit. I hope you enjoyed our review and uh, see you in the next video. Bye and God bless.